Hello and welcome to this Map Pro 5 screencast. Today I'm going to be talking about importing a remote host from a host provider. In the first remote video I went over with this test load host, test upload host, uh, exporting uh, my website or publishing my host. And I did publish that and I still have it here at user.mam.info. This is the live site. So what I'm going to do in this video is import this live site into a different host. Okay, so the first thing I need to do now is create a host. I am going to call this import host. I'm going to make it the basic WordPress install here. Uh, document root I need. And create that. Admin two three and create the WordPress host. I'm just going to let that install and save and restart my servers. And this uh, will be a basic install of WordPress. If I open that up here, you can see the basic uh, WordPress host. Okay, so I have my host set up, my WordPress host. I'm gonna to go to the remote tab and use the uh, check the use remote server um, text box uh, to get things started here. And I am going to use this uh, button here, this drop down, and I'm gonna pull all the credentials from test upload. So this is going to save me uh, a lot of time in filling out all these fields. So. Uh, here's, you're familiar with this from the previous export or upload video, uh, user.mam.info, username and password, this is all filled out. Uh, it's going to be the same uh, remote database that I'm importing from, and uh, all the information is going to be the same. So I'm just going to save that. And, and uh, what I want to do next is check the credentials for this host uh, to see if they are good. So uh, my credentials are good, and all I have to do now is uh, import my host. Okay, so I just have to import the host here. I'm gonna import the host. Uh, some warnings, of course, about backups and that kind of stuff. So this is downloading from the uh, remote server, and it is going to move this WordPress site uh, from the remote server onto my local Mac here and my MAMP Pro installation. This could take a little bit. Okay, so it's done. So if I go back to my general tab and click on this button, this is the uh, page on my local machine here, and I have the uh, modified version of uh, the WordPress that was previously on my host provider. And that's gonna do it for importing a host in MAMP Pro 5.